As part of this segment, I'm going to show you guys how do you customize your instrument cluster to show the battery temperature of your Tycon and why this is so important. So let's go and hop on the inside. I'm going to show you guys how can you display on the right tube of your instrument cluster to show what the battery temperature is of your Tycon. But why is that important? Well, if you're going on a longer road trip or even going to charge at an Electrify America charging station, you want your battery to be between 86 and 95 degrees as that is the optimal charging temperature so you can reach those faster speeds of charging time. This is gonna help us save time as I know that's, that's one of our biggest assets in life is time savings, so this will help you save time. Now, if you have the destination for that Electrify America charging station already input to your car's PCM, the car's already gonna start preheating or pre-cooling the battery. So by the time you get to that charging station, it's already gonna be in that optimal temperature and charge the Tycon as fast as it can. Now, if that charging station's only a couple miles down the road, that's not gonna give us enough time to get that battery to that optimal temperature, which is okay. It's just as soon as you get to that charging station, it's gonna take just a little bit longer to get the battery between that 86 and 95 degrees. So how do you display that on the right tube of your instrument cluster? So here on the PCM, we're gonna go ahead and select settings. Then we're gonna go ahead and uh, select displays. We're gonna go ahead and do instrument cluster. And then here on the second one, we're gonna see customized view. So go ahead and press that. And then you can set it to any one of these four lines as part of that right tube. I'm just gonna go ahead and do line four. And then you'll see it's gonna show right here, battery temperature, I'm gonna go ahead and select that. And now I can see that the battery temperature of my Tycon is 67 degrees. So it's a little bit cool to be able to hit those optimal uh, charging speeds because it needs to be heated up a little bit. But if I were to set the destination to an Electrify America charging station, the car would automatically start to heat or cool the battery on my way there. If you guys have any questions about how do you display the battery temperature in your instrument cluster or how do you use the charging planner, go and leave a comment down below. I really appreciate you guys watching this tutorial on the PCM 6.0. Now just a little piece of bonus content. If you're not on this screen, which is called your power meter, I'm gonna show you guys how do you get to this screen so you can see what your battery temperature is. You may be on something called extended map. If you're on that, it's as easy as using the little roller on the right hand side of your steering wheel and you have to scroll up and go power meter. If you don't have this center section selected, you can use the little right hand arrow on your right portion of your steering wheel to move it over to go to the different tubes. You wanna make sure that you're on the center tube so you can go and you can use the roller and go up to power meter and then you can see this information here. You may have something else on here. Maybe you have drive mode. Again, you just use your little roller, make sure that it's selected right here in yellow. You can scroll down, go right down to information, push the little roller in, and that is how you will display your battery temperature.